Welcome back on a Monday night. The home of the future is here. Your smart allows you to control nearly every single thing in your house with Wi-Fi from wherever you are. Your thermostat, your security camera, even the lock on your front door. But there's a price for all this futuristic convenience. You might be giving strangers access to what is happening behind closed doors. News 3's Kelsey Thomas is live for us at a smart home in northwest Las Vegas to explain how it's happening and, Kelsey, also to explain how to protect your privacy if you live in one of these houses. That's right. This is one of the most high-tech homes I have ever seen. The security camera, even the thermostat and the TV, they're all connected to the Internet. The homeowner, he can literally sit in his living room, control them all with his smartphone. But we found many high-tech gadgets in your home have serious security flaws. Real estate broker and musician David Lee has a lot to protect in his home. It's just more of a safe feeling, a comfort feeling. This hardcore techie can run his home from his phone. This is dark and then when you walk up to it, it senses your body heat and it, it turns itself on. He can control his thermostat, even his pool and spa. Just how you turn the heater on. He can watch over his entire house with 13 security cameras. So this has the infrared right here, which you can't see. He can see us, his drum set, his pool, even the golf carts on the course behind his backyard. All of his devices are connected to each other and the internet. He can control them with a simple app. So it's basically just not getting up so we don't have to do anything for ourselves anymore? Not really. <laughs> Imagine how wonderful it would be to live in a house like this. Technology has always been pushed forward, as depicted in this 1957 GE film, House of the Future. Here's a complete climate control operated by this panel in the kitchen. So you're doing everything at your fingertips. A convenience Cox Communications calls home life. Lock or unlock your front door from your phone, if you're even turn on your lights. What you can do is have the door tell you hello. Your lights are on. But that futuristic convenience could be jeopardizing your privacy. While David's smart house might outsmart a burglar, could it be an easy target for another kind of criminal? There's always a way to break something. Colby Moore is a professional hacker. He's part of a security team at Synac in California that helps companies find weaknesses in their own products. I'm continually continually shocked kind of by the state of state of the security out here. Colby tested 16 popular devices including cameras, smoke alarms, and thermostats. He found weaknesses in every single device. We were able to gain initial access to each device in really about under 20 minutes. It takes Colby less than five minutes to hack into this home security camera. So now we have complete control of this device. Which means if he can do it, a total stranger could easily spy on you going about your daily life. Watch you, uh, to kind of figure out your pattern of life, watch your children. So you're watching someone's child and they don't even know it, basically. And they don't even know it. From hackers to trackers, some companies monitor you through your coffee pot, your fitness band, even your crock pot. If an appliance uses Wi-Fi, it can transmit data. It's in the fine print of your purchase agreement. It's almost like background noise now. We, we don't even see it. We just routinely click on it without realizing that we've now given up that information. Attorney Richard Jost specializes in privacy issues. People are scared or angry to have a governmental agency gathering that information and yet we all give it up over and over and over again every day. Cutting edge can but at what price? Do you ever worry about someone coming in and hacking into your but system? That's a little bit of a concern. The government gets hacked into, Sony got hacked into. So, yeah, there's probably people out there that could do it, but I think there's a lot more of a chance of someone breaking a window. So how do you outsmart the hacker? Use a strong 